You may have heard that baking soda or sodium bicarbonate can offer some benefits, but like with anything, there are pros and cons to consider. In this video, we'll break down how it works, the potential benefits, and the risks involved, so you can make an informed decision about whether it's right for you or a loved one. Let's explore the surprising ways baking soda may influence kidney function. Firstly, we will talk about pros of baking soda for kidney health. Baking soda helps balance the body's pH levels because it is alkaline. In people with chronic kidney disease, the kidneys have trouble removing extra acid from the blood, which can lead to a condition called metabolic acidosis. This buildup of acid can cause tiredness, trouble breathing, and muscle weakness. Baking soda can help reduce the acid by neutralizing it, which can take some pressure off the kidneys. It may also help improve kidney function and prevent long-term problems caused by metabolic acidosis. However, it's important to use it with a doctor's guidance, as using it incorrectly can cause harm. Research suggests that sodium bicarbonate, baking soda, might help slow the progression of chronic kidney disease by addressing two main problems, acidity and inflammation. In CKD, the buildup of acid in the blood, called metabolic acidosis, and the inflammation that comes with it can damage kidney tissue, making kidney function decline faster. Baking soda may help neutralize the excess acid, reducing the strain on the kidneys. While these benefits make sodium bicarbonate an interesting option for managing CKD, it's important to use it carefully and under the guidance of a doctor to ensure it's safe and effective for each person. Enjoying this video? Hit subscribe to stay updated with essential health tips and the latest updates on our channel. Metabolic acidosis, which is common in people with chronic kidney disease, CKD, can harm bone health. When the body becomes too acidic, it can cause calcium to be taken from the bones, leading to weaker bones and a higher risk of fractures. Baking soda can help by neutralizing the excess acid in the body. This can restore a more balanced pH level and may reduce calcium loss from the bones, helping to protect bone density in kidney patients. This is especially important for people with CKD, who are already at higher risk for bone problems due to kidney issues and other health complications. However, like with any treatment, it's important to use baking soda carefully and under a doctor's guidance to make sure it works as intended without causing other problems. Now we will talk about cons of baking soda for kidney health. One important thing to keep in mind when using baking soda for kidney health is that it has a lot of sodium. While sodium is necessary for the body, too much can cause high blood pressure and fluid buildup. For people with chronic kidney disease, it's especially important to control sodium intake because the kidneys may already have trouble filtering out extra sodium. People with CKD should be careful with baking soda and talk to their doctor to make sure their sodium levels are safe. While baking soda can be helpful for kidney health, it's important to be aware of the risks, especially the possibility of metabolic alkalosis. If baking soda is overused, it can make the body too alkaline, which can lead to problems. When the body's pH gets too high, it can cause symptoms like nausea, muscle twitching, confusion, and even serious issues like heart arrhythmias or breathing problems. To avoid these risks, it's important to use baking soda in moderation and always under a doctor's supervision to make sure the body stays in a safe pH range. Baking soda can interact with different medications, which is especially important for people with chronic kidney disease who often take medicine for issues like high blood pressure or heart disease. The high sodium in baking soda can affect how certain medications work, like diuretics or blood pressure medicines, by changing fluid balance or blood pressure. This could increase the risk of side effects, like swelling or higher blood pressure, which might worsen kidney function. Baking soda may also affect how other medications are absorbed or broken down in the body, leading to unpredictable results. Because of this, it's important for people with CKD or those on multiple medications to talk to their doctor before using baking soda to avoid harmful interactions. We've covered the important pros and cons of using baking soda for kidney health. Remember, 
always consult with your healthcare provider before making any changes to your routine. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell for more health tips and insights. Stay healthy, and I'll see you in the next video.